Hi everyone, welcome to Stone Camp's online show channel. This is Ginny. Hi everyone, this is Sophia. Today we brought here our newest products, the AI camera serials, which means artificial intelligence based pedestrian detection camera system. Audience may be curious why we would need such a system for vehicles. Well, the main purpose for these cameras is to improve the driving safety when driving. There are many blind spots. You can see, as shown on this board, its orange areas are blinding spots. These blinding spots make it very difficult for the driver to recognize if there are pedestrians passing by, which is very dangerous. And with such an AI camera system, the risk of traffic accidents could be greatly reduced. Okay, that sounds very useful and yeah. it can really help to safeguard the vulnerable pedestrians on the road. So now let's start our exploration of StoneCam AI cameras. As far as I know, with AI algorithm inserted, AI camera is able to detect certain body parts such as heads, arms, legs, or even postures such as squatting or bending down. So before the AI cameras learn and detect, we need to teach them first. Calibration is our first and once for all teaching step. You say we have two categories of pedestrian cameras. One is for look around, separated into horizontal version, it's called ADA32, and vertical version is called ADA38. Another category for look down is called at A37. Yes, each of them is using different calibration methods via the calibration tool and web UI that our engineer developed. So it means they have their own separate lessons to learn. In order to help our audience to get a more specific idea, let's get into details on how this could be done and what preparation should be undertaken before it's fully functioning. Now you can see all the wiring is done here and the cameras are connected to the monitor but there is no any control unit in between because all the algorithm is uh, inserted to the cameras already and this is a trigger output uh, which can enable the cameras to communicate with external devices such as the alarm buzz of light and sound and this is a Wi-Fi module uh, for calibration. Yes, it's very easy to deal with calibration. Just get this Wi-Fi calibration tool connected and part on. Search out the Wi-Fi on the phone and get them connected. Then you can do calibration through our verb UI. Yes, and you can see that after calibration, there are three colors on the monitor and with the closest red color indicating the most dangerous area. And you can also change the size and form of this uh, detection area uh, through the web UI. So now I will show you how to change it and how it will uh, change accordingly. Uh, so now it's in rectangular shape and I will change it to a trapezoid. So yes, as you can see, the monitor will uh, respond immediately after I made some change on the web UI. Except for calibration, we can also make some settings and adjustments with this web UI interface. For instance, the sensitivity degree, display mode, and so on. For further functions, we will leave you to explore. So to make a conclusion, our AI-based pedestrian camera system can greatly improve driving safety by broadening driver's viewing area and sending on-time warnings to avoid accidents. Please remember, the AI algorithm is achieved within the camera, so there is no need for external control unit. It will be safer, lighter, and easier. Okay, and that's all the basic introduction to our AI cameras, but still some audience may have some questions. So we have prepared a Q&A part for you. So now let's see the first questions. 
uh, how many people can be detected at the same time? Uh, this is a good question. Thank you for asking. Uh, our system is able to detect up to 50 people uh, because in fact 10 people on the road is already uh, crowded. Uh, but if you have needs for uh, more people to be detected, we are capable to uh, customize uh, these needs. Really impressive. Then let's go to next one. Why there are so many virgins? Oh, what a great question. So there comes a story. First of all, we only have one model for set view. But we know from the feedback that our calibration for horizontal version, horizontal view in front and rear of the vehicle is also in great need. That's how the train cameras in horizontal version developed. Then again, Customers consider a pedestrian camera from a bow perspective is also quite needed in real application. And that's where look down category of pedestrian camera comes. That's this ADA37 is developed. We always pay attention to customers' voices. Yes, indeed. And due to limited time, let's have one last question. Uh, can the camera work with other systems or be integrated to uh, our own platform? Thank you for your question again. Uh, our cam AI cameras are able to work with other systems such as DVR uh, as a merely a camera input and as for integration that won't be a big problem because we have powerful R&D team so they are definitely capable to meet all your customized needs. That's all of our live show today. Thanks for watching. I hope our demonstration and answers could help you to get a clear idea on our products. If you are interested in our products, please feel free to contact us for more information. We are expecting to see you soon again. Have a good day. See you. See you.